Why can't we travel through a black hole? That's an exciting question. Firstly, let's get into the importance of a black hole. Black holes are among the most abundant astrophysical objects in our universe. These intriguing objects appear to be an essential ingredient in the evolution of the universe, from the Big Bang till the present day. They probably had an impact on the formation of human life in our galaxy. The universe is littered with a vast zoo of different types of black holes. They can vary by size and be electrically charged, the same way electrons or protons are in atoms. Some black holes actually spin. There are two types of black holes that are relevant to our discussion. The first does not rotate, is electrically neutral, that is, not positively or negatively charged, and has the mass of our sun. The second type is a supermassive black hole, with a mass of millions to even billions of times greater than that of our sun. Besides the mass difference between these two types of black holes, what also differentiates them is the distance from their center to their event horizon, a measure called radial distance. The event horizon of a black hole is the point of no return. Anything that passes this point will be swallowed by the black hole and forever vanish from our known universe. At the event horizon, the black hole's gravity is so powerful that no amount of mechanical force can overcome or counteract it. Even light, the fastest moving thing in our universe, cannot escape. Hence the term black hole. Inside a black hole is where the real mystery lies. According to Einstein's theory, time and space, in a way, trade places inside the hole. Inside the black hole, the flow of time itself draws falling objects into the center of the black hole. No force in the universe can stop this fall any more than we can stop the flow of time. According to Stephen Hawking, black holes are slowly evaporating. In the far future of the universe, long after all stars have died and galaxies have been wrenched from view by the accelerating cosmic expansion, black holes will be the last surviving objects. Most black holes that we observe in the universe are surrounded by very hot disks of material, mainly comprising gas and dust or other objects like stars and planets that got too close to the horizon and fell into the black hole. These disks are called accretion disks and are very hot and turbulent. They are most certainly not hospitable and would make traveling into the black hole extremely dangerous. To enter one safely, you would need to find a supermassive black hole that is completely isolated and not feeding on surrounding material, gas, or even stars. Now, if a person found an isolated supermassive black hole suitable for scientific study and decided to venture in, everything observed or measured of the black hole interior would be confined within the black hole's event horizon. Keeping in mind that nothing can escape the gravitational pull beyond the event horizon, the infalling person would not be able to send any information about their findings back out beyond this horizon. Their journey and conclusions would be lost to the rest of the entire universe for all time. But they would enjoy the adventure for as long as they survived the circumstances inside the black hole. <laughs>